Hello guys, I hope you are doing really really well. Today I have with me Amazon Kindle Scribe and in this video I am going to show you top 10 settings for this Kindle. So guys, the first setting is related to show clock while reading. Okay, so for example, I open a book and you can see there is no clock showing on top. Okay, so if you want to see the clock on top, you can enable it. So what you have to do is you just tap on top like this. So a new window will open and here you see this first icon. Okay, it says AA. Okay, so you just select it. So once you select it, a new window will open at the bottom. Okay, and you see this option of more just select it so once you select it you can see over here this option it says show clock while reading so you can enable it okay so once you enable it now you can see the clock is now showing okay so even if I scroll to the other pages okay so you can see the clock is now showing on top okay so this is the first setting. The next setting is related to display size. So you can change the display size. You just uh, go back from here and then you see at the bottom we have this option of more just select it so once you select it you will see a new window and here you see this option of settings just select it so once you uh, select this settings option you can see this option of device options just select it so once you uh, select it you will see this option of display settings just select it so once you see this display settings option the first option over here it says display size just select it so once you select it here you can see currently it is set to large okay so if you want standard you can just select it from here and it will also show you the demo over here so for example if I go to the standard one okay so if I go back okay so this is how it looks like the standard one but if I select the large okay so this is the large one Okay, so this is how you can change the display size. The next setting is related to landscape mode. So how to enable the landscape mode. So for example, I open this book. Now it is in a portrait mode, but I want it in a landscape. So I just tap on top like this and then I select this AA icon. So once you select it, a new window will open and here at the bottom, you can see this option of layout just select it so once you select it here you see this option of orientation okay so here we have portrait and here we have landscape so i just select the landscape mode so once i select the landscape so it will be like this okay so now uh, you can read in this format in the landscape mode the next setting is related to word wise option so for example I open a book and here I want to uh, see the meaning for different words okay so how to enable this option I just tap on top and here you see this AA icon I just select it so once you select it at the bottom you see this window and here you see this option of more just select it so once you select it you have to just scroll down okay and you see this option of word wise okay currently it is turned off so i will turn it on so i will go inside and i enable it from here okay so once you enable it you will see at the bottom we have this word uh, wise option now available but if i just disable it okay so you can see it will also disable from here so i will enable it now what i will do is for example i am on uh, this page of my book i just press this word wise option okay now this small window will open and currently it is uh, hidden okay so i will just uh, select this show option okay so you can see it is giving me fewer hints more hints so whatever you want you can select so i select more hints so as uh, i select this word wise option you can see it is giving me uh, different uh, meaning of words okay so for example like this respective belong to each person uh, okay furnish to provide with the furniture uh, okay and then quickly and easily this readily uh, instantly immediately so different uh, suggestions it is giving me related to different words okay so if i go to the next page okay so you can see over here now it is showing me uh, the meaning of different words here as well 
okay so if you want to enable this word wise option uh, you can use this setting the next setting is related to how to see the table of contents for a book okay so for example i open this book okay and i want to see the table of contents so i just uh, tap on top like this so a new um, window will open and here you see the second icon over here with three lines okay with three broken lines so you just select it so once you select it a new window will open and here it will show you all the table of contents uh, with the page numbers as well okay so if you want to go directly to that uh, content so you just select it okay so it will open the same page for you the next step is related to how to set time in uh, your kindle okay so if you want to change the time uh, you can change it just go uh, into this option of more okay so once you enter into this more setting uh, just go into the settings option so once you enter into the uh, settings you will see this option of device options just select it so once you enter into the device options uh, you see this advanced options okay so just select it so once you select it here you see the very first option it says device time just select it so once you select it it will open uh, the device a time menu and here you can change the time so for example if you want to change the minutes the hours so you can change it from here and then once you finish you press ok the next step is related to how to reset your kindle scribe so if you want to reset your kindle scribe just go into the more ok just select this option of more so once you enter into the more you see this option of a settings just go into the settings once you enter into the settings you see this option of device device options just select it once you enter into device options you see this reset option over here the second last so you just select it so once you select it it will ask you this section will remove all downloaded or transferred content from your kindle and your settings will not be saved you will still be able to download items from the cloud so it will ask you the last time do you still want to reset your kindle so if you want to reset it you just press this recent option and it will reset your kindle the next setting is related to power saver so if you want to save power for your kindle so you just select this option you have to go into the more okay so once you enter into the more you will see this option of settings just select it so once you select it here you see this device options just select it so once you select it the last option over here it says advanced options just select it so once you select this advanced option here you see this power saver okay it says a low power sleep mode to conserve battery life okay so you just select it so once you select it it will ask you to enable it or disable it i already enable it so for example if i disable it it will uh, show me like this not enabled so if you want to enable it just select it and here you see this enable option now visible you just select it and it will enable the power saver mode the next setting is related to dark mode if you want to enable the dark mode you just have to scroll like this from top this menu will open and here you see this option of dark mode if i just select it so it will uh, change my kindle into the dark mode so everything will be in this format okay so for example if i open a book the book uh, will be in the dark background you can see the words okay so this is how it looks like in the dark mode but now i prefer uh, like the normal mode so i will just disable it uh, the next uh, setting is related to changing of templates in your notebook okay so for example i go back and then i select this notebook from here okay and now for example i have uh, this uh, notebook i have this notes okay so here you can see this is the page template but i want to change it okay so i just tap on top like this okay and then you see this first icon like a book okay you just select it so once you select it it will take you to the notebook settings and here it will show you 18 different type of templates so you can select any uh, template from here for example i want uh, let's say this template so i just select it okay or this one okay so you can see now the template is changed now this is how it looks like if i go to the other pages so the template will be changed for those pages as well so guys this is for today's video please like my video and please subscribe to my channel thank you very much